Hey guys, look at that. Look at that. Oh yeah, oh yeah. So I, um, I'm meal prepping right now. I just got done boiling my pan of chicken. It looks so delicious. And um, so this is everything that I'm packing. So 12 ounces of chicken, 300 grams of sweet potatoes, which I already cooked. Um, 230 grams of black beans, which are right here. I'm just gonna season them a little bit. Um, 160 grams of green beans, which are cooking right there. Oh yeah, look at that. And I gotta season those as well. I season everything. Then, um, two bags of rice cakes. So I definitely like ate pretty much all of the damn rice cakes. Not all, but I ate a good amount today already. Um, rice cakes, I eat a lot of those the day of show. These are for breakfast on the day of show. Um, this is amazing, like I love having these oatmeal on the day of show, just very filling. Um, full of carbs, which I need. It has a good amount of protein as well as fat. So I'm gonna do that Friday morning and um, Saturday morning. I have a s'mores Pop-Tart just so that you know, I don't know when I'm going to eat that. Who knows? This is for pre-pump up stage, like 30 minutes, 30, 30 to 20 minutes before stage time. S'mores. This is just because I wanted to try them. Um, who knows when I'll eat those? I have no idea. I don't know if I'll do it before show or after show. Uh, as you guys know already, I carb up on the day of the show. So, I mean, I can really carb up on anything I want. So pop tarts, Oreos are all fair game. Um, got my got a new box of cinnamon toast crunch, and then this one. I mean, I'm not gonna need two boxes, but there's just a little left in the other one. Um, I got my bowls ready, and coffee I'm drinking right now. And um, yep, these are my sweet potatoes. So what I do with these is I just microwave them for like six minutes. Look at my hand. Six minutes, let it get nice and soft. I prefer them cold as opposed to um, hot, but it's it's great to get them nice and hot and get that sugar, look at that, sugar just dripping out of there. It's delicious, I love it. So yeah, I'm gonna measure these out. Measure out, I'm cooking the green beans that I have on high as heat for some reason. Cooked in coconut oil. And then that's pretty much it. I'll show you guys everything as I am doing it. Here we go. It is, um, it's Thursday. It's, it's, it's Wednesday. Wednesday. This is taking so much longer than I wanted it to. So I have all my meals done now. Monday through freaking Saturday, okay, and somehow I miscalculated my chicken, so I'm making two more ounces of chicken for Saturday, um, and so here we go. This is meal number one for, this is, I'm going on a road trip tomorrow to Vegas, so I had to pack all of my meals um, for tomorrow as well. So um, this is meal one along with that. This is meal number two. Mm, yeah, look at that, so good. Mm. And then meal number three, uh, same exact thing as meal number four, and then I'll have dinner at the hotel. This is meal number one on the day of the show. This is meal number two on the day of the show. And this is for, actually this is like a serving of rice cakes is a snack before pre-judging. This is my post pre-judging meal along with some chicken that I'm making right now. Actually no, this is my post pre-judging meal along with, um, rice cakes and then I'm gonna go out to eat at the hotel and then this is Saturday morning or no breakfast oatmeal meal two meal three meal four cooking chicken and then snacks meal five I won't go on stage probably until about mm, midnight or so so I still have a full day of eating on Saturday Maybe I'll vlog that, maybe I won't, who knows. But this is all my snacks that are going to keep me full throughout the day. Mostly rice cakes, like all day. And then I have a bunch of like almost finished things of peanut butter, so I'm like taking them all. And besides that, this is the damn labor of traveling 
Wow, competing. Holy shit, my day. So, actually, I'm in a rush now because I need to go um, have a full body shave session. And hold on, let me turn this around. So, anyway, I need to have a full body shaving session and go exfoliate my skin and get ready because I am getting my tan. I'm like, <laughs> I'm getting my tan tonight at 6.45, but it's 2.30 right now and then I have to eat again and then I have a client at 4.30 and then after her I have my, um, my tanning at 6.45. So, rush, rush, rush. All of this chicken, all of this food is prepared and ready and I'm excited and ready to go to Vegas. Yeah, like holy, oh, like, oh, what? <laughs> oh my god. Honestly, like, things are crazy, guys. Things are insane right now. Like, I got, like, I did, so earlier today I did my, I'm just gonna bend over like this, this is annoying. I did my last lifting session, okay? I did cardio and then I had a client and then I did lifting afterwards. Then I went to the gym to go in the sauna for 20 minutes and then I went to Walmart and did some grocery shopping, okay? And then came home and had my second meal. So that was my day today. Um, but I'm telling you, after my last lift, it like hit me. like. I could go pro this weekend and honestly this journey has been absolutely insane. It's been three years of competing. This will be my eighth show I believe, um, which I know a lot of people out there have done like crazy amount of shows but this ain't about them, this is about me and to think that I have a chance to become a pro, like I just got like emotional, like happy tears because I feel so proud, I'm so proud of where I am and how hard I've been training, how hard I've worked to get here and how how much I got knocked down and did not freaking stay down. I stayed up and I kept fucking going and I did it and I cannot stress enough how much of a win this is for me and how, it, how um, important this is to me. Um, I was like seriously just felt overwhelmingly happy after my posing session and just overwhelmingly like just proud of what I've done like this body I built I did this all myself I don't have a coach I don't have anybody I did this all myself and when I say I don't have anybody like I truly just I mean I have followers that say hey you look great and like you know people that tell me I look good but other than that like I have no hand I have no help like um, and I know there are a lot of people out there that are in the same boat so I, that's why I want you guys to like appreciate what I've done too because nothing no outside help whatsoever no coach no one to, no one to help me like give me motivation when it's time for me to be down I mean yeah I have my boyfriend but he he goes he has his stuff and like I don't know it's just it's really just me by myself and I'm fucking proud as hell and honestly, I'm just like lump in my throat, like, oh, <laughs> like my. I'm very happy with what I'm bringing to the stage, and it's so silly because it's like so aesthetic, it's so like self-centered. It's such a such a sport that's like all based on you. You're in the mirror 100 percent. You're um, checking yourself out. You're taking photos. You're weighing yourself. All this stuff. It's very self-centered as fuck. But there's way more to it. There's way more to it. And once you realize the depth of accomplishments you can get doing this sport once you realize that you can go really really far because it's not all about looks it's about inside it's about mentality it's about mental health and it's about everything and i'm just so fucking proud of where i am inside as well as outside and this weekend i won i fucking won already i won i don't give a fuck what the judges think <laughs> like whether it's great or not I know that I did an absolutely amazing job. <laughs> and uh, on that note, let's hope that I get first place because um, that'd be just icing on the cake. Like, this has been a really hard year for me. Like, when I say year, I mean year. Like, s well, seven months. <laughs> so, 
Um, yeah, it'd be great to win, you know? So, me. I am in a rush, I have a client, blah, blah, blah. Other me. Hey, let's do a motivational speech right now of how happy we are 10 minutes later. Like, this is what I do. All right, guys, thank you for watching. Um, I'm gonna take you through the rest of my day, my craziness, I'm gonna vlog what I can. Thanks for watching and um, stay tuned. Yeah, I'm so excited. I leave for Vegas tomorrow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs>
that's my update. I'm about to eat. And then um, I'm going straight to check-ins, going to register, get my number, go meet the judges, go see people. And then I'm going to go check into my hotel, make sure I have a microwave or a, a refrigerator. And then I'm just going to chill all day, man, and just eat. Um, for dinner, I am going out to eat. I usually have like a fatty, carby meal. Um, I don't know what that'll be yet. I know they have a buffet, so maybe I'll do a buffet, but I would much rather order an entree so that I can actually, you know, decipher exactly, uh, fuck. I just realized I forgot my food scale. Damn it. <laughs> That's okay. Um, I don't need it. I have a bunch of prepped meals already, but I kind of wanted to measure the food that the buffet has. But anyway, I am going to the buffet or a um, dinner, a steak dinner, or like some random shit. I don't know. It's Vegas. There's so much food. Like, I didn't even make food plans because I don't want to, um, I don't want to because there's so many places to choose from. It's just sickening. I'm like, okay, cool. Like, whatever. I'll eat when I eat. So, I, I um, stalled a little, so now I can eat. So, I will check back in with you guys either at registration or when I get to my hotel room. Yay! I'm so excited! You don't even know. I'm so happy and so excited and so fucking, just fucking, like, ah. Okay. <sighs> Gazing far into the night, I raise my hand to the fire, but it's and, um, 16 minutes away from the venue where I am going to be checking in. I really hope that um, everyone. I hope I'm not the. I hope that it's not packed at this time. Can you guys even see? checked in um, at the hotel and so on the, on the, it's about it's going on five o'clock right now and you better believe like seriously I time my meals to the exact minutes and I'm like okay five o'clock let's go let's go five o'clock and like five o'clock could not be here any sooner for a real hold on yeah, so I checked in, and honestly, I'm I'm crazy excited. I mean, I don't really know how else to say it. I'm fucking stoked, and so, what was I gonna say? Okay, so I am going to eat my meal, which is green beans, um, chicken, rice cakes, and peanut butter. Same shit I've been eating. And then two hours later, I'm gonna go downstairs to the buffet and just fucking eat carbs eat fats carb up fat up and um that's pretty much what the night is um i'm not i don't really have a structure of what to eat tonight a lot of people usually do steak tonight a lot of people do burgers and fries blah 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 but we'll see what the hotel has i'm sure they have a burger i kind of would like love a burger so that's my little check-in i'm gonna show you guys my my beautiful abs right now i mean just um Staying nice and tight. This morning, by the way, I woke up at 11 point, I mean, 117.2 was my weight. Like, so low. And I want to say, and I know this is like too much information, but I have not pooped today. <laughs> I have not. And those who compete, you know this is a big deal. This is a, di I mean, it makes a huge difference in your physique. Like you're just a lot flatter when you do so i'm like let's go let's go and if that's too much information for you guys like seriously like we're all human we all do this shit okay like chill take a chill pill all right look at that oh my god no matter what happens you better believe i'm fucking happy i'm so happy with where i am yeah 
I will check back in with you guys later or I'll see you tomorrow. I'll probably check back in because there's not shit to do. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. Bye. Look at that.